Good afternoon guys and welcome back to my channel. In the last week I've been having emails from Samsung Direct uh, for me to do an unboxing on one of their products, their latest products that is. This is a Samsung Galaxy Tab S4. It's going to be amazing to do an unboxing on this and a basic setup. I will try and go through it to the best of my ability to explain the procedures and what's on offer with this product. So guys, stay tuned. <laughs> Shout out to Samsung for sending me this. It must be sent back, guys. It's only on loan, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna be really excited into uh, to doing this product. Okay, then, guys. Here is the Samsung Galaxy Tab S4. It comes in a nice matte black box, and it also has across the front here um, a Tab S4 in a metallic blue, which is quite nice. So, uh, fair ado, guys. Let's open the box and see what's inside. Right then guys, inside is the, the Samsung Galaxy tab. <clears throat> Let's just pick it up by your second. And it comes nicely wrapped in a silk bag. Let's take the device out. Right then guys, it looks absolutely amazing. Um, it seems to have on the bottom, a dual speaker system. It has a USB-C and it also has a headphone jack as normal, what you would expect from a Samsung product. Let's turn it around. It, holds, it also has a glass back on it as well, guys, as you can clearly see by there. Um, the only drawbacks that I can see straight away is fingerprints. There's a lot of actual fingerprints coming from me but I guess you would put it in a case and that would eliminate that problem. Right then, let's place that by here. Further inside the box, we have a quick start. There's a warranty card. And there's also a tool inside here as well. Let's push this out a second. I'm not 100% sure whether or not this is allowed because the item is basically on long like I send it back. Right, I believe this is for a SIM card that can actually put into this item and this is a tool to either put it in or access by getting it by excessively getting uh, the SIM card out. So uh, that's that tool there. We also have inside the box um, a Samsung fast charge, which is pretty much what you get with all high-end Samsung products. We also have the USB-C charger wire which comes with it, which is pretty much standard, I think. You also have a tool inside. It's a bit like a pliers, um, but this is basically for guys, the actual stylus pen, which is here. And at the end of the stylus pen, the same as the majority of the phone accessories with the Note 4, Note 5, Note 6, Note 7, Note 8, and Note 9, you will get a pen with it and at the bottom you would actually get um, it's like a very very fine pen which you can actually use on the screen um, if this gets damaged then you would use these tweezers to actually pull out from the stylus pen and insert a new one so that is what that is for we also have a stylus pen as well which is quite quite heavy so I can actually feel the quality in it. Okay. Now that looks very, very nice. It's in a matte black. It feels a lot better. 
than the one that I've had in my previous note. So that looks amazing. Let's do a, just a quick comparison in the size. Here is the one out of my Samsung Note and here is the one that you actually get with this Tab S4 which is quite a difference to be honest and it feels a lot easier to actually use this than this small device. So then guys, I'm just going to put this back in here a second because obviously it must be sent back to Samsung. Put that by there. Um, it looks like there is more inside this box, but let's have a look. No, there's nothing. It's just um, just an empty case in. Right then. And I'm just going to place all this back inside here a second. And uh, let's turn this... Um, the system on. Top right hand corner button, the same as your note. And there we have Samsung Galaxy Tab S4. Powered by Android. And the thing is, with last year's model that I seen, it seems to be smaller bezels on the side, so it's probably making the actual system look bigger, but it's not, it's probably the same size as the Tab S3. Okay, let's press the start button. Insert SIM card, we will take a miss on that. Okay, let's go to here and put my password in. Okay then, now it's connected to my Sky. Let's press the next button, I guess. Okay, agree the terms and conditions. Okay. I agree to marketing information, contents to provide diagnostic and uses data in the license agreement, read the end of the license agreement carefully. It contains, it contains important information. Okay. I have read the above. Checking for updates. This may take two minutes. Checking in the information. Okay, so. Let me just put my email address in two seconds. My password now, so hopefully that's the right one. Let's put the next button. Okay, it agrees. Check in information. Get in account info, just a second. Choose it back up to restore. Okay, last use either of those, or last use, that will be here. Just a second. Choose what to restore. Restore everything. Restoring, you can continue setting up your SMT835. Okay. Okay. Okay then guys, this is what you have. Protect your tablet, prevent others from using your tablet without your permission by activating device protection features. Set up an intelligence scan. Use face and iris recognition together. Two, set up face recognition. Three, set up iris scanner. Four, set up pin pattern or password. Or five, no and thank you. Now the thing is, I still prefer like a little button by ear so you can actually press it because you've got a fingerprint scanner 
Now I noticed on the back as well, as it's glass, that it doesn't have this feature. I still think that it would be nice for, even though they've removed the buttons from you, it'd still be nice to have that fingerprint scanner on the back. Um, but this is what uh, Samsung has got at the minute. And, and obviously they always change in um, their technology all the time. No, thank you at the present time. Okay, device protection features will not be activated, so you won't be able to prevent others from using this tablet if lost, stolen, or wiped. I'm going to skip anyway. Checking information. Okay, next. Just a second. Okay, backup, right, okay. Okay, I agree. Updating. Add in the finishing touches. This may take a minute or two. Now I believe this product here retails for about six hundred pound. Um, you can get it through O2, or you can contact um, Samsung directly in Cardiff um, to actually get this product from them directly. Now the thing is guys, the reason how I managed to get this is because I built my channel up through about a year now and obviously Samsung has looked at my my channel and decided for me to do an unboxing on their product. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed, everything's going to go well. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it and also put a thumbs up, I will appreciate that. If there's any comments you wish to leave below, please do. Um, Smash that uh, subscribe button and hit that notification as well because you can see future videos that I will be putting on to my channel. So stay tuned and I really appreciate it guys. Okay, sign into your Samsung account. Okay, signing in. Okay, so I agreed in, I have agreed to the terms and conditions. I agree to the special terms. Okay, I'm just going to fill all these in anyway, and agree. Welcome to your Samsung account. Okay, next. Okay, loading your data. Okay. I agree. Finished. Check out the useful features. Extend your battery life. Secure your stuff. Front size and screen zoom finish all done your tablet is ready to use nice check that out i love my jap cars so that's all cool copy content from all devices i'm not going to be doing that okay then guys this is the samsung galaxy tab s4 it is basically all ready for to use um, it's quite self-explanatory. Lift it up. There you have your the apps. If you lift it over, there's further apps. And obviously you've got your buttons here on the actual screen itself because the bottom part has been taken away, um, which is pretty cool as far as I'm concerned because I'm starting to get used to actually using it. Um, the other thing is as well, on the bottom guys, Samsung has also put in four pins here so you can actually upgrade this tablet to a laptop feature um, it's a dock here and a dock there so you can actually have this tablet sitting into a keyboard and that is the future which Samsung believes that this is what you guys you know you're gonna push aside your laptops and you're gonna just be using this technology um, but if you guys do not wish to use this, then you can just continue using it as a tablet. And um, yeah, guys, there's the unboxing. And um, obviously there was the setup that you had to go through to get it up and running. Um, it's still downloading things in the background. Um, obviously that's to my account. Um, but yeah, I do appreciate um, Samson sending me this and hopefully Fingers crossed, everything will be perfect when it gets sent back to him. So, peace out, guys.